Look, give me the camera. Give me the camera. It's this recording. is this is super common with these cars. You can see it leaking brake fluid always. What are we doing today? This taking is, this uh, interior apart. Taking it apart? Yeah, we're taking the interior apart. We're gonna make it sh do shifty things. Shifty things? We're gonna give it something right here. Well, right in there. Oh yeah. yeah. It's missing something from the factory. Yeah, because it's got these like these weird like flappy yeah, pedal these, these things. like turning signal things. <laughs> yeah. So you're just tearing this apart, huh? Yeah, we're gonna tear it apart. We're gonna give it a lever right here and a thing right here. Yeah. Yep. Ooh, is this it? Is this the uh the shifty thing? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. That's my special box. It's your special box? That's a special box. Mm. There's so many things. Too things, many things. Things and stuff. Things so and you're stuff. you're um you're a Billy. I am I am a Billy. Uh-huh. And you do, I do car Billy. things? I do Billy things. Billy things? With cars. With cars. Taco but right now we're doing yeah, Taco Bell things. Taco Bell things. <laughs> Taco Bell things. Mike is Taco Belling the Ferrari. Oh yeah? Ripping its internals out. Oh, <laughs> What are you doing now? Me? Yeah. Pulling these covers off mm. so I can access the seat bolts. And I can pull the seats out. So you have to remove the floor to take the seats out? Uh, no. No, but I just remove the floor because it's easy. So I remove the floor on both sides, then I remove the seats, and then I gotta remove this panel right here, and then the dead pedal, and then we get to the good stuff, which is removing the brake pedal so we can add the special pedal. So what I've heard is that doing the pedal box is your favorite part. Absolutely not. <laughs> Absolutely not. You could ask anybody that has ever done the swap, that's probably the worst thing to do. <laughs> the pedal box. We'll get there. Is the car cold? The car, yes. We're, we put this sweater here so it can so it can stay warm. You were shivering earlier. Yeah, I was shivering. <laughs> My thumb is black and all I'm doing is interior stuff. Whoa. Huh? Is that a Ferrari thing? Yeah. yeah. It's a sticky stuff. Sticky <laughs> buttons, sticky everything. <laughs> everything is sticky. Well, that's how you know it's true and genuine, right? Yeah, it's not sticky. It's not original. Facts. It's a special sticky Ferrari goo. Special sticky sauce. Mmm, yes. <laughs> Very slow. <laughs> Three hours later. Dude, all I did was touch the seat, bro, and I'm just. Look at this. You're still sticky? Yes, dude. It's so <laughs> annoying. Real genuine Ferrari stick. It comes free with the with the car. <laughs> a little more complicated. Why? Cause you can't just take the 17 out here. They hit it right behind the carbon. Mm -hmm. So an easy way of getting to it is you flip the seat back. There's two T20s here. You pop those out, you move this out, and you can get to the 17 here to take the seat belt out. The other side doesn't have it because they make that seat go higher and more forward for the driver. Oh. So Ferrari things. <laughs> Two seats down, how many to go? Just two. Oh. <laughs> Just two, they're supposed to be lightweight seats. Lightweight, like 70 pounds. Doesn't sound very lightweight to me. No. The so seats are out. Seats are out. Seats are out, now what? I'm gonna take this back panel off. What's back there, are there secrets back there? What? Secrets, we're gonna find out. All the secrets? Yes, we're gonna take <laughs> this out, then we're gonna take this out, then the middle carpet out, and then we can do the pedal box. The dreaded pedal box of yes. doom. What the hell, look at this. What happened? This is how they give me stuff. Look how stripped that is. Oh yeah. Good Jeez. luck with that. Thanks. Is that that's genuine Ferrari? That's just stripped? normal stuff that I deal with. Yes. <laughs> yes. It's things that's supposed to be a Phillips or an H4, and they're circles. <laughs> but I don't have circle bits. So how are we gonna get it out? <sighs> Wait, what? We're good. We're good. They didn't over. They just probably use power tools or something to put this on. Oh, so it's good then. Yeah, it's good. It oh, okay. comes out. But it, I mean, it's definitely not good. I'll replace it because that yeah. looks terrible. Let's see what's behind this door. Door number one. Door number one. Door number two. A bunch of spiders come out. Don't say that. A bunch of spiders come I out. I don't like spiders. And then like they're all Italian and stuff. <laughs> spiders are gonna come out with their legs. He says Italian spiders. Italian spiders. They offer you a plate of like spaghetti Linguini. or something. Yeah. Linguini. 
and they have the hex pit in another hand. That they they're the that ones they, that they're, they're the ones that are stripping, stripping the bolts. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they're the ones that are stripping the bolts. Center console time. Center console time. Yes. Oh, Center yeah. console time. So how does this how does this work? Like, there's no there's no cut out here. Ah, uh, magic. <clears throat> you hit up EAG and it just appears. Oh yeah. Yeah, dude. You just you just wait and it just appears and then you get some sort of lever down there that you have to press and stuff. It's, and then we can get rid of these uh, turning signals. Ferrari likes to hide bolts everywhere. Mm. So I'll put bolts here, bolts under there, bolts under here. Do make sure you can't take it off. Yeah, like that. <laughs> just hidden stuff. They just hide stuff. These are famous for being sticky. These. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. So you got more sticky stuff on your fingers, or? Yeah. No, no, no. Oh. This one's actually in really good shape. This one's nice. Oh, it's been replaced. It's aftermarket. It's definitely been replaced. <laughs> it's usually when the car sits outside. These cars can't sit outside for more than like five minutes. Yeah, they just they start. They just start melt. To, they start to melt. Yeah. Mm. That's unfortunate. But yes, we won't be needing this anymore. This guy. No? No. We just chuck it or what? Yeah. No, we're not going to chuck it. No. We're definitely not chucking it. Not today, anyways. No. Pulling out this carbon piece. This place gets replaced with one that we make for the special stuff. More bolts? More bolts. Lots and lots of bolts. And now the best thing that Ferrari does, which is they switch the hardware like three times. They'll go from like H's to Phillips heads to eight mils to just anything, anything from their hardware store in Italy. They just, they just, they just put it on. These there's parts. no like continuity whatsoever. No, 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 no. Anything that they can get from their Ace Hardware, mm -hmm. I don't know what they call it over there in Italy. Mm. But, oh, the Bibbidi Bobbidi store? Yeah, the Bibbidi Bobbidi store. Now we gotta protect. Like this guy. Yeah. Yeah. You wrap it. Yeah, we wrap it. Safety first, or always. You don't want nothing to get on it. Right. Or scratch it, or don't want to become infected or anything. I thought she was ready to go. Oh, there's always one more bolt. There's, huh? there's always more. There's always there's one more. more. It's literally always more. The reason I wrap it is because you could scratch it. You don't want to scratch it. Yeah. You gotta protect it. So, oh, when you take it out. Yeah, yeah. Yep. Makes sense. There we go. Cutter box time. So, a lot of people take. This whole center part, which I've seen, I don't think you need to do that. I know that there, there's like a hole somewhere in there that's like a straight shot for one of the bolts in the pedal box. If you have two extensions and a magnetic 13, it's like a cheat code. You gotta take this guy off, take the pedal face off, you know, take this panel off completely, at, and then you'll pull off the carpet. And then once you do that, you pull off the dead pedal, and then you can get yourself in there. We got that guy out of the way. We can take this guy off. And usually, 99% of the time, these are already stripped. I guess that's how they torque them from the factory. So you don't you don't mess with it, or so somebody has messed with it already, because these are circles at this. So out of all the 599s you've done, it's it's always the case. It, no, it's like hit or miss. So you get lucky sometimes, or or you don't, like this one. All right, I'm just gonna leave this here because I gotta take the whole pedal out, so I can just take it out once it's out of the car. Oh, okay. We gotta pull this carpet off. Now it's dead pedal time. Dead pedal time? Yeah, you gotta take the dead pedal out and then... You have to bring it back to life or...? Yes. Gerald! Yeah. We're trying to vlog here! <laughs> Be quiet over there! <laughs> More bolts. Uh, yeah, you, so you got 10 mils and then you got Phillips. I've had these strip out too. Is this stripped over there too, bro? Uh, not this top one. This bottom one is. Oh my god! I don't know why. It's like they build some of these cars like in a rush. Go give it CPR. Or something. Is it alive now? Uh, no, it's still dead. Oh, we'll just put it right there. And just... oh, okay. <laughs> What's next? Uh, take the brake pedal off. It's got a funky clip on it. This is your favorite part? Or what? Uh, I'm already used to it, dude. I've done so many of these cars. It's not bad for me, mm -hmm. but I also have really skinny hands. I've seen like Billy struggle. I've seen everybody struggle trying to take this off because you need to get under the dash, as you will see. Look, give me the camera. Give me the camera. Triple this a. is this is super common with these cars. You can see it leaking brake fluid always. They all leak from there. I've, I've pulled out so many. You the brake masters from there. Mm. It leaks into the booster, and then you can lose brakes. Okay, pull the pin out on the brake, on the brake pedal. Mm -hmm. There's gonna be a pin with, with two clips. Take the clip that's closest to the driver's side, and then you just push the pin towards the passenger side. So you can bring this pedal down, and then there's gonna be two clips 
two plastic clips to take the whole pedal off. That's the easiest way to take the pedal off. Really? Just clips, huh? Yeah, just clips. Clips hold your brake. Pull this pin out. Now you can bring the pedal lower, like so. And then you gotta pop the clips off that hold the physical pedal. This is how the clip goes. You push in here and you shove like a flathead on the other side while you're pushing. Mm -hmm. And then it pops off on one side and then you do the same as the other side. A lot of people break these clips taking them off. And then you're screwed. More pedal box stuff. More pedal box stuff. Now I'm actually at the pedal box. It's gonna be, it's gonna be four 13 nuts that hold, uh, get, uh, hold the pedal box to the booster and then it's two 13 bolts. The funnest part is to put it back in. Oh yeah? Yeah. Putting it back in because in, you're gonna have the clutch master sticking out. I already got the annoying bolt off. So, magnetic 13. Makes life easier. Now to pull the pedal box out, if you mm -hmm. want to show a little bit. You're gonna turn it counterclockwise this way. Please. This is the part that everyone struggles with, all right? That's it, you just do that. Brilliant. And you get it out without having to take out all the bottom stuff. Now to put a special pedal in it. Hey. hey. We're gonna put the upper portion of the pedal into the pedal box. So, so it goes like this. Yeah. This is our pieces, right? This is our pieces, correct. Yeah. And then we'll slide it in. And you have a pedal now. This is the upper portion, and then the other portion will be here, so you can have your fun pedal. That's the fun pedal That's portion? That's the fun pedal, yes. We're gonna remove this panel so we can get access. To? Back here, there's gonna be a plate that looks like this guy. Mm -hmm. And then we are replacing him with this guy. Oh. And then he will go connected to our clutch pedal. And that is our magic pedal. Clutch master's in. Like Mike showed earlier, pulling out the factory plug. And then we just insert our master. All right, upper portion of the clutch pedal's on. Pedal box is going back in. The fun stuff. Into my hole I go. <laughs> is it more difficult to put it in or take it out? Uh, it's more difficult to put it, put it in because now you have the clutch master sticking out from under here. So it is, it is more annoying. But now you were going counterclockwise, take it out. Now you go clockwise. So same spot, go in, and then you just clockwise turn it into place. And then these skinny hands help. And it's on. I just need to put the bolts back on. It's time for the clutch pedal. Time for the magic pedal? Yep. Okay, that's it. Oh, that's it? Yep, that's it. Just it. It just works. You just yep. you tap it a few times and mm -hmm. put the bolt in? Yep, yep, look. Boom. Oh, yeah. Yep. We're gonna set it right here. Okay. That's a little, it's a little high. Yep. Like one half turn higher. Higher? Yeah. It's right there. That's good. That's good? Yep. How much higher? You want it this higher? Yes. Pedal box done? All done. Yep. Go Billy. Computer's out. Computer's out. Where are we at? Pedal box is in. And time to get rid of these things because we don't need them while we're going. ECUs are off to see the wizard. The ECUs are off to see the wizard. ECUs are out. They're gonna get programmed. And goodbye to these. No more of these? Nope, no more of these. Okay, bye. Bye. Have you been recording this whole time? No. No? That's a lie. I'm here to ask you about your car's extended warranty. Oh shit.